I left my radio on, my Motorola XPR 5550, I left it on for, oh, maybe two, three hours, and I come back, and this is the voltage running out of my Epic power gate. And I got no lights, no nothing. I guess the battery could have run down, but it was should be going a lot more hours than just two, three hours. So let's go turn the engine on and see what happens. So you're going to have to bear with me. I'm just one guy by myself. So let's start this baby up. And voltage is 14.27. I'm going to turn on my radio. Not that it's going to make a difference, but I'm turning it on. Okay, the power to the car is on. It's feeding 14.15 volts to the Epic power gate. But you see no battery light at all on. Nothing. I don't know if I have to wait 10 or 15 minutes for the uh, power to go through the epic power gate and to the BMS and the battery and the battery maybe raises some voltage and it starts going. I don't know. Uh, I have had it on for maybe 5 or 10 minutes now and I see nothing. So I'll wait a few minutes longer and then let's see what happens. Um, I do suspect that if I unplug the battery and I plug the battery back in, you're going to start seeing action. This is not the first time it's happened. I'm just not sure what's going on. So let's wait a few minutes and see what happens. So I turned on the power and the car is now feeding 14.13 volts, 14.12. And the battery is charging. So, I guess the battery got drained, although kind of quickly, too quickly, I would think. But, at any rate, I start up the engine, and then nothing happens. You saw that the battery had no lighting whatsoever. I started the truck up, and nothing was affected, nothing at all. The only way to get things rolling was to unplug the battery from the Epic power gate, and then plug it back in, and that's when things came back to life. So, my question is, what's the problem? This is only a few minutes later, and it dropped from 14 to 13 volts. Jumping up and down a little bit. So lastly, I turn off the power after about 10 minutes, and it's blinking red, and the voltage is 11.19. So that's the last step of the test. 